Chronic wasting disease is a highly contagious, incurable, and always fatal neurological disease that affects deer and elk. It's already been found in northern Missouri. Now the Arkansas Game and Fish Commission says it's confirmed that state's first case. KY3's Dustin Hodges reports tonight it needs the help of local landowners to make sure that disease doesn't spread. We need your help. The Arkansas Game and Fish Commission is sounding the horn about chronic wasting disease in deer and elk in the natural state. It's highly contagious. Um, it can be uh, moved from uh, deer to deer, elk to elk, or elk to deer. And, um, you know, it's in Arkansas, that's a, a big deal. The state found its first case in an elk last week. Something the Game and Fish Commission says does not bode well for the state. We have a large hunting culture, especially deer hunting, um, and we just reestablished elk. And we want to make sure that it's around for generations to come. It's, the disease is always fatal, uh, so there's nothing really that we can do except try to contain it. In an effort to do just that, the Game and Fish Commission is conducting a study to see how prevalent the disease is. It plans on testing about 300 deer and about 50 elk within a five-mile radius of where the infected elk was harvested in Pruitt. But to do that, it needs the help of nearby landowners. We're going to hunt them. There's no live test, so you've got to uh, take a piece of the brain and, uh, and test that uh, and the uh, lymph nodes. We want to talk the, to the private landowners. Uh, that um, have, have uh, property around the park and get them on board so that we can test these animals. In Springfield, Dustin Hodges, KY3 News. Now the agency hopes to get results back within just a couple of weeks. All of the meat harvested in the hunt will be kept in freezers and if the animals do not have CWD, that meat will then be given back to the landowner.